All right, guys, we've got our OSC 13 built by M13 Industries out here today, and we are going to run some Detroit Ammo Co. Subsonic 545 by 39. And we also have our Silver Bear here to compare to Supersonic and two suppressors, the Sandman K and the Sandman S. We do know that, or we were told that the 545 will not cycle the action, but we do want to see how quiet it is. So let's get loaded. Do the K first. <laughs> wow, that is so quiet. I am shooting at the ground right in front of the target so you can hear how quiet this is that's just insane <laughs> just shoot over on the wood side <laughs> it's so quiet wow one more round that is that is very, very quiet. That's insanely quiet. All right, so let's alternate some subs and supers. See what it sounds like with the K, and then we'll switch over to the S. Subs and supers. <laughs> this is supersonic. There's a little bit of a difference there. Yeah. <laughs> it's giggle worthy every time. <laughs> All right. So let's do it with the S suppressor now. If this is our RRD4C Sandman. All right, first up subs, then super, sub, super. Wow, I could, I can actually tell a difference between the S and the K with the subs. I mean, that is super, super quiet. There's not a whole lot of difference between the S and the K uh, on 545 supers. I really like the K on 545. <laughs> it's classic. <laughs> that's awesome and that is it all right guys head over to detroit ammo co and check out these subsonic 545 rounds 55 grain they will not cycle the action as you saw but they are crazy quiet super super quiet and of course check out dead air with their sandman s and sandman k suppressors these things are phenomenal not to mention J Mac Customs for the RD4C Sandman. This is our GBC 13. And of course, this rifle is the OSC 13 by M13 Industries. Here's our new stock adapter. This is the RSA 4.5. Allows you to install SIG style stocks, fold and lock in place. And this is the new KGB LLC aluminum machined grip. J-Mac Customs, more than just a firearm.